Hey guys, welcome. Hemo here. Okay, so what are we going to do today? Okay, so as you guys may know, uh, the Golden Apple Archipelago had just returned. Yes, for the for the event. Uh, so. So, we're gonna go there right now. Uh, I miss the, uh, the Divalin Airlines. <laughs> are we, are we gonna go take, take the route again? The Divalin Airlines. Are we gonna go there to Divalin Airlines? <laughs> I miss that meme. In any cases, uh, first, let me just change my language to to English because certainly for sure there's going to be uh dialogues in here and then we're gonna head off to Mondstadt and Will happen again? Hello, uh, right. Okay, but first off, um, Golden Apple Archipelago Exploration Team. Okay, that should be enough. We have Kazuha, of course. And then Xinyan. Am I ever so glad? I'm taking the stage. Am I ever so glad that Xinyan is a um, is a shielder and off field character? Because, as you know, I don't I don't use Playmore users. Uh, then we have Fischl, of course. The threads of your fate lie in my hands. And then we have the last one, which is Mona, which I just recently got her. Um, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Don't tell me. This is how it must be. <laughs> wait. <laughs> no way. No way. Did Mona, did Mona just drop? On my wishing session for Kazuha because she wanted to go to 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 the Golden Follow Apple the Archipelago. You know, because she and Kazuha is the only one who I was missing during this time. <laughs> no way. <laughs> I don't believe this. She actually dropped on me because she wanted to take a vacation. Yeah. It's probably because she's having troubles uh, paying for her rent. <laughs> oh. I better... Uh, I better bring her along to the Daily Commission. She'll at least have something. <laughs> um, but first... What am I going to give her? Should I just give her the, uh, the, the hydro, the hydro build? Would, would that, would that work? Um. Ocean New Clam is for, is for healers and Mona is no healer, of course. Oh, there isn't anything else. Um, I'll give her... No, not that. <laughs> no bless a blush. Um... I'll give her wonder... Uh, the two set wonders. 
for elemental mastery is probably much more better. Since I don't know what to give her, I'll just go with a bow. Um, elemental mastery. And then I'll give her the two piece hydro part of that. Last one would be This one, mm, elemental mastery to you. Oh, it doesn't have any. I don't have elemental mastery in here, so fine. Crit rate and crit damage. For her weapon, I remember I have that seashell catalyst. I first gave it to uh, Hazel, but I was told that it would be better. For he so the wind wind sit. This wind sit. Oh, but I think she would be better for a wind sit too. Or should I give her this one? <laughs> Oh, just this. I, I think this one is better. Wow, all right. Um, I can't believe I'm actually I can't believe I'm actually leveling her up just for this event. Oh, I, I'm going to need to um. This was ordained by fate. Long had I foreseen it. She actually has energy re uh energy. What do you call it? Is that energy recharge? Yeah, she has ER for 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 an upgrade. So she's So I think she could possibly be more of a support. One step closer. Maybe. Uh. 
My heart is breaking. <laughs> Wait, I think I I think I can get this uh I can't believe I'm actually using Mona. Shadows of fate. <laughs> Wait, didn't she have her? Let me use this one for the first. a lot no I I should be I should be over the cavern to start the event but I'm here what the what the heck am I doing? I'm here trying to gather materials for... <laughs> for Mona. <laughs> what am I doing? Please someone tell me what am I doing. <laughs> I'm not even gonna use her. What the heck am I doing? <laughs> If there is anyone I should be I should be leveling up, it should be uh it should be Sayu. <laughs> because Sayu can help me get uh get some materials from from farming animals, from farming meat, from farming, from farming crystal cores. I can't believe I'm actually doing this. Wait, um, Springvale should have a lot of these too. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> Yeah. 
Is this enough? Is this enough, Mona? I can only upgrade you up to 50. Probably. I better stop. <laughs> I better stop. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> oh. All right. But it's just one more too. But it's this water board. By a degree of equivalent to 20%. Oh! Okay. So she needed... Uh, so this is not elemental mastery. This should be... This should be energy recharge. But there's also energy recharge. Many ranger recharge is a lot. Wait, what? The crit damage is 125? All right, energy recharge. Energy recharge. Part of that. No, it's it it it's wondrous rope, right? Energy recharge. All right, let's let's go back <laughs> and and go to the golden apple. <laughs> what what did I do <laughs> for the last uh, twenty minutes? <laughs> what was I doing? <laughs> Follow the wind. Oh no! <laughs> what about Sinyan? I don't think my Sinyan is also level. Um, uh, what would be good for Sinyan? Uh, wait. What does... What does her shield depend on? Ah, uh, it depends on death. Okay, okay. I'll, uh... Probably give her husk of appealing things to make her shield thicker. Oh, the attack damage and the oh, but this one has death and death. So I'm gonna give her full death for all of the cup just Oh. Hmm. 
We have nothing. Oh, wait. Just need the bell. Well, I suppose there wouldn't be any because I usually throw away the the full death uh, thingy. So I guess anything goes. There's some energy recharge here. So let's just go with HP. I'm sorry, Chong Yun. Can I borrow? Can I borrow your weapon first? Since uh, she's very low leveled, her shield would definitely be very, very easy to break. How are we going to get to the? Golden Apple Archipelago. Are we going to take the Devalent Airlines again? Ah, Traveler. It so happens that a friend of yours asked me to pass on a message when I saw you. Oh, who is that? Someone left a message for us? Huh, who could it be? My beloved retainer, have you noticed that silver thread of which fate is woven, now twisting and twining itself around you? The Aug de Vertalung does. Mm, oh, it's it's does special. Grossen Kaleido Phantasmus will be watching you. At first, I thought it was Mona, but <laughs> with the with the rest of the sentence, it's definitely special. <sighs> <laughs> Even Catherine is exasperated. <laughs> Apologies. This message is unusually difficult to recite. Would you like to hear more? It's better to just go find Fischl. Uh, definitely sounds like Fischl's note. What should we do? I'd love to hear more. We'll be watching you as you step into the glorious castle of the Immer Nockreich. Come to me at once. Swear an oath to me in my blessed name. And we shall journey together to the depths of the world. Poor Catherine. <laughs> anyway, to summarize, Miss Fischl asked me to ask you to go to the plaza in front of the cathedral. <laughs> Please meet her there when you have the time. She said that she will be waiting for you. Oh, Fischl. Such a mystifying message for such a plain and simple request. <laughs> As always. Well, if Fischl's expecting us, then let's not keep her waiting. Let's head towards the Cathedral Plaza. Okay. Let's head to the <laughs> Cathedral Plaza. Yeah. Ah, uh, there she is. Oh, Mo Mona is with her. There she is! And Mona, too! Oh, welcome, 
welcome, most loyal attendants of the Princessin. <laughs> most loyal attendants. <laughs> I, official Princess and Diverto Tolong, have descended upon this realm from my Imernach. Tretch. <clears throat> as decreed by Destiny Doom. Each and every day, my familiar Oz and I observe every weft and weave of fate. Apologies, Miss Fischl of the Adventures Guild can be hard to understand at times. I would like to remind you on behalf of the Guild that the official dictionary is there for you should you fail to comprehend her words. The official dictionary is Oz, apparently. You may also ask her companion, Mr. Oz, for help. Oh. Overall, however, Miss Fischl is the most trustworthy investigator. I hope that you will work well together. Oh, I wonder if she'll uh, do well teaming up with Hazel. Which one is it? Retainer or attendant? Make up your mind. Oh, she's already in her alternate outfit. My apologies. Main Fräulein tends to use exaggerated expressions <laughs> when she's in good spirits. That she does. You were looking for us, right? Sounds like the fun started without us. What's got you in such a good mood? Nice to see you all again. It's been a while. And so, the Whisper of Eternal Night summons you back to my side. Mm, splendid. What a blessed reunion. A boon from beyond the eventide. Come, partake of this joy with me, my subjects. <laughs> Traveler, Paimon, it's a pleasure to see you again. Main Fräulein and I extend to you our most sincere greetings. Paimon wants to say a proper hello too, but Paimon has no idea how to... uh... partake. <laughs> a normal person in this situation would simply say, Hi, Traveler, how have you been? <laughs> Fine, thanks. <laughs> the Traveler and I are like intertwined stars in the vast galaxy. You of all people should very well know the fate foretold by this meeting. Precisely. Lady Magistus, please refrain from such unimaginative utterances. <laughs> I can't believe you're also <laughs> agreeing with her odds. Lady M... <laughs> Oh, what now? Is that your new nickname? <laughs> <laughs> Lady Magistus has long since become a citizen of the Imanakreish. She has been serving as court archmage under one's command for some time now. I thought archmage is a silent age, so I always read it as archmage. <clears throat> That's just my surname. Don't mind that. <laughs> This is so embarrassing. You're here because Fischl asked Catherine to ask you to come, right? Yes, and uh, it gave Catherine a whole exasperation. <laughs> I can't believe Catherine could actually be exasperated, too. Indeed so, my archmage. Did even this appear in thy divination? Why, your powers are truly dangerous. Oh, for the love of... No, of course not. You told me yourself that you'd left a message with Catherine. <laughs> <sighs> Excuse me. Anyway, in my case, she practically beat the door down to get me to come along. Whatever she says, please, don't be too astonished. Ah, uh, don't worry. We've been around the block. You can't phase us. <laughs> really? <laughs> if you get... If if you get phase Pyman, let's see. Oh, faithful servants, one's homeland, the Imanok Reich, which bears the darkest of all fates, draws near to this world once more. Stand with me in anticipation, for the glory of our kingdom is nigh. <laughs> is this much more worse than than what the uh the the abyss order is doing? Uh... <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> you said nothing is going to phase you, Paimon. 
<laughs> What's that face of yours now? Indeed. Only one's <laughs> most faithful envoys are fortunate enough to be privy to this great revelation. <clears throat> the Imanok Reich is near Mondstadt. Okay, I'll report this to the Knights of Pavonius immediately. <laughs> no, please. That will be most unnecessary. <laughs> I know it sounds absurd, but there's actually something behind this, I promise. That's uh, probably something. Uh, I sh if we consider Mona being here, there's no way she would she would do anything with with ridiculousness. <laughs> there's definitely something. Basically, what Fischl means is, oh, Lady Magistus. <laughs> What? Why are you stopping her? Uh, all right, all right. Honestly, look at me. A genius astrologist forced into a juvenile role-playing game. <laughs> true, very true. The truth is that yesterday, Her Highness encountered the Spark Knight Klee outside of the city. Both being of great fame, they recognized one another instantly and began to converse. Oh, so it's because of Klee. Well, Klee was our our main our main heroine for when we went to the Golden Ar uh, Apple Archipelago a year ago. Was it a year ago? Yeah, I think it was a year ago. It was already getting dark, so, in that spirit of great compassion and care for which she is known, Her Highness personally accompanied Klee back to Mondstadt. On the way, she Her Highness relayed to Klee the story of her origins. Upon hearing the tragic tale of the fall of Her Highness's homeworld, the tender-hearted Spark Knight inquired, with tears welling up in her eyes. Klee is probably coming back from fish blasting again. <laughs> Oh no! Is the Imanakreish really gone? Won't it grow back? <laughs> I can't believe that Oz is actually playing through this. Oh mortal, your sovereign's heart is touched by thy sincerity and sympathy. But nay, the Imanakreish is an everlasting realm, and one day, it shall make its reappearance. Really? So how do we make your homeland grow back again? Oh, please tell me. Please. Please. <laughs> that... That... That video zoom in. I can't. I can't. Since you inquire so earnestly, <clears throat> give unto me a tranquil haven. Promise me eternal admiration. Lend me both time and wind, and one shall revive one's homeworld. Could you cut the reenactment and just get to the point? <laughs> Thank you, Pyman. <laughs> In short, Klee gave Fischl an island to serve as the promised land where the Imanok Kreish will appear. I didn't believe it either at first, but then I saw this letter. Oh, it's Alice. <laughs> After all, Alice did sort of uh, give Klee the, the archipelago, didn't she? It's the princess of the Imanar Trash. I am a witch who travels amidst the mountains and rivers of Tevat. I write to you, having heard from my young daughter that your kingdom has fallen and that you are searching for a way to restore it. Amid the seas under a far-flung sky may the Golden Apple Archipelago be found. If this masterless land can assist in the restoration of your highness's realms, that would be most wonderful. And Alice just played along because, you know, it's the request of her precious daughter. Masterless land. Masterless land, though, I do not think so, because, you know, I think Alice has laid claim to the Golden Apple Archipelago. Providence has gifted Main Fräulein with an excellent opportunity. Esteemed Traveler, as Main Fräulein's cherished retainer, you deserve to bear witness to this grand moment with us. <laughs> this island looks kind of familiar. Um, uh... <laughs> All right, it's time to go look for Venti again. <laughs> Traveler, curtail thy umming and awing at once. The throne of the Imanok Reich calls for me. Come, 
be my blade. Clear the way and witness what is to come. Uh, no. I, I think she just wants to invite you along to the island with her. <laughs> <laughs> that being said, I have a feeling that I'll be better off not performing any divination where that island's concerned. Don't worry, we've been there once already. Huh? Why not? Klee is involved in this, which means her mother is probably involved, which means that old hag is involved. <sighs> thanks, but no thanks. <laughs> oh, that's right. She could, uh, her master, her, her master could end up finding her. <laughs> and there is still the matter of her reading the diary. What can I do for you, your highness? You, who have traveled to the farthest reaches of the world, Fathom the celestial path of stardust in the palm of your hand, and witness raindrops converge and become one with the undercurrent of destiny. You. Yes, you. Must chart the course that leads the way to the land promised to main Fräulein by fate. Uh. <laughs> oh, Fischl doesn't know the way there! I knew it. <laughs> Look at that face. <laughs> <laughs> for our help. Paimon can tell if you that we are good friends with the Spark Knight Klee, the Guides of Destiny. <laughs> I can't believe this cinematic view. <laughs> Paimon, seriously. Come on, just play along. <laughs> Very well, I am the one who had traveled here from beyond the stars. <laughs> Behold, the Watcher. The guide, the weaver of dreams, the traveler. <laughs> I'm getting second-hand embarrassment from this. <laughs> <laughs> excellent, most excellent. I hope no one is watching us. <laughs> oh no, a crowd of amusement tatters. <laughs> traveler, since you say you know the way, we'll let you take us to the island. I mean, the promised land. For the princess. Oh, good, fine, done. Uh, right now, um, Lady Magistus needs to go home to pack her things and catch up on some sleep. Your Highness, your uh, other distinguished selves let's meet at the city gate at nine o'clock tomorrow morning so we're gonna go look for venti right very well then it is settled one blesses you with an undisturbed slumber lady magistus you too traveler so uh if i remember correctly kaswa should be here so he would be coming visiting here right main Fräulein means to say good night see you all tomorrow about darn time Good night! <laughs> oh, Paimon's exhausted! <laughs> uh, you all have proper rules! How come Paimon has to be a clock on the wall in the royal palace? <laughs> Paimon, you're the one who started it. <laughs> anyway, since those islands are a pretty mind-blowing place, why don't we get some people with mind-boggling ideas to help us out? What? We're not going to ask them. Kaya's mind works in mysterious ways. But no one in Mondstadt has ideas that boggle the mind quite like... Quite like who? A certain somebody who's definitely <laughs> going to be in the tavern at this Come on, let's go rope him into helping us. All right, it's it's time for venti hunting. The golden apple vacation returns. Right, definitely. <laughs> Venti's the only one we can we can cry for help. Oh, there's still some some. Mushrooms here. Mushroom. I saw some here too. This is Fatui territory, you hear? What? Excuse me, Fatui. Who's that? Where are you? 
Follow the wind. Wow, you put to his lane claim to an entire hotel. Radiant spin crystal. I should do a video of trying to hunt them down. Oh wait, I I can't I can't come in from here. Oh, I thought that was the right entrance. Oh! It's Kazuha and Sinyin! So that's how they got roped into it. What are they doing in Mondstadt? And they know Venti. Whoa, look at that! You're really here! Come on, take a seat and join our delightful conversation. Wow, Traveler Palmon! Speak of the devil, we were literally just talking about you. Truly a curious coincidence. Kazuha? Shinyan? What are you doing here in a Mondstadt tavern? And how'd you end up having to share a table with the Tone Deaf Bard? Tone Deaf Bard? <laughs> <laughs> now that's a fun stage name. It seems like you're a pretty well known singer, fella. <laughs> Though sadly not a rock and roll singer, or we could perform a duet. So, you all know each other. My newfound friends are my old friends' friends from afar! <laughs> How fantastic! What? My newfound friends are my old friends' friends from afar. Oh! <laughs> That's kind of a tongue twister there. My newfound friends are my old friends' friends from afar. <gasps> this is a rare opportunity indeed! Oh! We should form a poetry club and call it, uh, the Free <laughs> Poet Society or something like that. <laughs> you guys came here from Leeway? Yeah, I felt like getting out and finding some new inspiration for my songwriting. Kazaha felt like going on a trip too, so we figured we'd travel together. Last month, Beto held a big booze-filled party called the Drink Till You Sink Championship, and she put me in charge of the music. And that's where I met Kazaha. Drink Till You... <laughs> Although Xinyin can come across as unruly at times, her musical understanding is highly nuanced and original. Safe to say, our shared appreciation for music struck a chord in us both. Oh, you can say that again. In Kazaha's hands, even a leaf becomes an instrument. That makes him an expert among my friends. Starting from Liyue, we passed through Stone Gate and kept going until we came into Mondstadt. Then along the way, we saw this really awesome manor. It was something else. Manor? Oh, yeah! Is that... We know the one! Our friend owns that place! Are they talking about, uh, the wine... The winery? <laughs> really? Y'all sure have a lot of friends. Well... Whoever it is that lives in that fine place must be really loving life, huh? Yeah, uh, it's definitely, uh, the winery. Uh, yes so. <laughs> <laughs> if you must know, the, uh, the owner of that manor happens to be the owner of the, uh, the establishment we're all currently in. <laughs> Similar souls tend to attract each other. <laughs> Traveler and Paimon, you must have exceptional taste, just like that friend of yours. Uh... <laughs> If you're going to meet, once you meet Fischl, I hope it's not going to, uh, you're not going to think of us differently anymore, Kazuha. <laughs> wow, you're too nice. Unlike some people who only ever seem to poke fun at Paimon. <laughs> 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 you poke fun at people too, Paimon. By the way, do you know anything about the Iridescence Tour? It's supposed to be huge. Rumor has it that all seven nations of Tevat are gonna be involved. 
Iridescence tour? Huh? Never heard of it. Well, so far it's mostly just empty promises. Anyway, it's supposed to be a music festival. The organizer really did a number on me last time. They canceled on me. But I hear that they're still active. Oh, right. I thought it was familiar, but then I... I remembered uh, that Shinyan was in Inazuma. And that it was cancelled, so I thought it was a different kind of tour. I'd love to give the festival another shot, but wouldn't you know it? The plans fell through again! How can they mess up this bad twice in a row? It's prob- they're, they're probably... Hmm. That's definitely suspicious. I mean... When you make a, an event like that, it certainly would cost a lot of mora. There's no way you would just drop it at the drop of a hat. Music is all about inspiration. Maybe the organizers canceled the show because theirs dried up. But fear not, weary travelers, for your journey was not in vain. It has, after all, brought you here, to me, to the Temple of Music. <laughs> <laughs> temple of music. Your temple of music must have more than just good tunes. You're a bard, ain't you? A song's gotta have a good story or it doesn't make the cut, right? <laughs> yeah, that's exactly. just it. Oh, you understand the meaning of being a bard so well. To express my gratitude, uh, I will even share one of these stories with you. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> oh, you're a funny fella. Are all bards like you? Well, not... Not, not really. I've met many bards during my travels, but none of them are as entertaining as you. <laughs> I'm sure it all comes down to the richness of my imagination and, by extension, the poverty of theirs. Well... And on that note, here is a fantastical tale that is sure to delight you all. Well, after all, you've lived for a thousand thousand years of course you would have a lot of imagination and experience traveling from all over to that <clears throat> legends tell of an emerald isle in the middle of the ocean there the dodo king and his people live a blissful existence <laughs> Funnily enough, he's also mentioning the Golden Apple Archipelago. <laughs> when a Dodoko is born, it dives into the water. Some learn to swim. Others are carried away by the waves, all the way to Mondstadt, where they befriend the children there. One Dodoko made a new friend in Mondstadt, the little Spark Knight. But the Dodo King did not approve. He demanded that the little knight come to the island and prove herself to him. <laughs> how does how did Venti know? So the little knight, together with her most important oh. friend in the world, braved the wind and waves, finally reaching the middle of the ocean. But Dodo King was not there. Dodo King had lied. No, oh, the patriots are are listening in. There was no trial, by fire or interrogation. The little knight's mother, who was a mage, had built an entire summer city there as a gift to her daughter, along with this message. Summer is the season of love. It is the time for freedom and fun. So everyone, <laughs> please sing, dance, and enjoy yourselves here. Interesting. I now have the urge to visit that island myself. This is the thing about traveling. You can't plan ahead. Better to leave when the mood takes you and go where the heart leads. <laughs> I'm glad you liked it. Well, there's wine on the table and I have stories to tell. 
Seems like fate is feeling kind today. <laughs> Here's to music. Huh? Come on, traveler. <laughs> don't worry. If you don't like wine, there's juice as well. <laughs> In that case, I'll have a glass of juice. Hmm. This one. I like the color. Which one? Somehow you get dragged into drinking one glass after another until... Until the... <laughs> he thought it was just it was probably alcohol. Uh oh, this fella's drunk. But uh, wasn't he drinking fruit juice? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. More, 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 more. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> more, more, please. <laughs> <laughs> what are we? Here? What's happening? Oops, I think I accidentally placed some fruity cocktails out there. Uh, my bad. <laughs> Fed to you! <sighs> Seriously? <laughs> anyway, guess it's time to talk about business after all that drinking. You came here because you need my help, I presume? I, I, I bet he got it from the wind. <laughs> Here to drink. Venti, come with me. <laughs> We're going to ask for the Devolent Airlines again. <laughs> Kazuha? Kazuha! Oh, he just won't wake up. <laughs> Looks like we're staying in the tavern tonight. <laughs> Even if you are a close friend. I need to learn to handle my booze better. Oh, what would you like? we need to go upstairs. Hmm, look where we are. <clears throat> yep, I can sense that you're about to tell me something very interesting. No, oh, come on, I know you know what we're here for. You tell Venti about the Spark Knights giving an island to special He gave a special friend. gift from her mother to an adventurer friend? Oh, she's such a kind-hearted child. As I'm sure you've already guessed, that letter is most definitely written by Alice. Right. Yeah, that's so. Speaking of, <laughs> guess which two people I ran into on my way to the tavern today? Is it Klee and... And Fischl, is that the reason why he knows? Hmm. Master Jean? Or Lisa? A mother and daughter, both with long elf ears and the most amazingly adorable personalities. Oh, Alice and... Alice is actually in Mondstadt? Alice came to Mondstadt? Really? Alice and Klee? <laughs> Oh, I want to see Alice. I want to see what ding, she looks like. Correct dancer. The unaging mage was taking her teeny tiny knight on a vacation, and I happened to run into them. As a friendly greeting, the mysterious woman gave me a gift. What? She also said that if I meet any fun friends, I should share this gift with them. So now it's yours to keep. What is it? Oh no! <laughs> Get that away from us, Betty! Minus the fuse, so don't worry, it's not going to explode. <laughs> Come on, take it! This way we can talk to each other just like this, even when we're apart. Oh. Wow, that sounds impressive. It's called a Dodo communication device, and it allows people to stay in touch over vast distances. However, you can't just use it anytime you want. And there's also a limit on the number of times you can use it. That's why it's currently only available to a certain select few. Oh. Uh, so so does that mean that Alice is using us as a uh, as a guinea pig for this? <laughs> is that it? I heard that the inspiration for this comes from another world. <laughs> Alice is always full of surprises. Another world. Which world? If I remember correctly, the world that has communication devices among the other games of of Hoyaverse is, of course, 
Honkai back third. She and Klee asked me to tell you. <clears throat> Please take this with you when you depart for the island. No, wait. The promised land with your friends. And have fun. No. Uh, that's probably the reason why Venti knows we're going to be looking for him. Don't worry about how to get there. The organizers of this vacation have made arrangements. Turn right after you exit the city gates, and you'll see something that will make you very happy. Really? Sounds I, like I, the two of you are in cahoots over this. I'm definitely for sure it has to be Devalid. Otherwise, I'm not sure how we're going to get to the island. <laughs> of course not. Is that really the sort of person you think I am? Yes. Yes, we do. <laughs> Traveler, you're my friend. And as your friend, I just want to give you something that'll make you happy. How can you think this of me? <laughs> All right, I'll go. Ah, fair enough. <laughs> the Toad Deaf Bard does like to joke around, but he's still one of our best friends. Besides, a vacation sounds great. <laughs> Actually, Kazuo and Shinyan seemed pretty interested in coming on this trip, too! Let's ask them if they want to join us! That was very quick coming down. Oh, you're back! Poor Kazuha's still out for the count. Seems like he can't handle alcohol so well. Shinyan, do you want to come to the islands with us? Adventure can't. <laughs> what? Huh? Uh, he doesn't want to go anymore. He seemed really interested just a moment ago. Can't miss <laughs> oh. <laughs> the adventure. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Kazaha might act mature, but deep down he's just another youngster eager for new experiences. That must be why he didn't think anything of the fruit juice earlier. Well, all the more reason for you to join the island trip. You know, a lot of people have praised the beautiful scenery there. Even Bart's. What? Did the Bart's actually got there? How in the world did they manage to get to the, to the archipelago? Okay, sounds like a plan. How do we get there? By via Devalin Airlines. <laughs> Someone's got it covered, apparently. There'll be a few others joining us on this trip, and we're meeting at the city gate tomorrow morning. We'll wait for you. Kazuha, wake up. We're going wandering. Mm. Mm -hmm. Traveler? Yes, yes. Oh, yeah. They don't know official yet, do they? Okay, so here's the deal. There's a princess from a faraway land and her retinue who are also coming on this trip. Huh? <laughs> look at... Look at Xenia's confusion. <laughs> uh, Paimon, don't get me wrong. I'm just asking to make sure. But from the way you're plugging this trip so hard, uh, did the iridescence tour folks put you up to this? No, no, don't worry, Sinyan. The Iridescence tour didn't approach us. It was a different set of people altogether. After all, canceling the Iridescence tour after people already made the trip, that's kind of the same thing as tricking people into going traveling, ain't it? Yeah, she did. She did have that experience. Ugh! Why won't anyone believe Pan? <laughs> 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 don't worry about that for now. You'll all have the chance to get acquainted with each other tomorrow morning. Whether you're a princess, a retainer, a talking raven, a samurai, or a musician, you're all VIP guests of the island on your summer vacation. And that's what counts, right? Right. Oh, I'm sure looking forward to it. Are you coming to Venti? No, I don't think he's coming. Otherwise, he would be on the on the poster trailer. Uh, I'll have to pass. I have some work to take care of. What kind of work? <laughs> I'm interested to hear that. 
You serious? The dog <laughs> deaf bard actually has plans to do some work? <laughs> See, even Paiva doesn't believe it. <laughs> I promised a young lady with cat ears and a cat tail that I'd sing at her tavern to boost business and beat the competition. Ah, yes, the competition being this place, which has six-fingered Jose. Oh, it's Diona. Aren't you allergic to cats? <laughs> oh, yeah, there is that. Yup, I can always sing on their roof. Oh, <laughs> Really, no. She told me that as long as their sales surpass their competitor, there's a whole month's worth of wine in it for me. <laughs> oh, what a fine employment opportunity. Virtually tailor-made for me. <laughs> well, good luck. So have fun. And don't worry about me. <laughs> I feel like this summer is going to be a very interesting one. Booze better. Wait till the next morning and eat. All right. Uh, what time was it? Ten, right? Eight. <laughs> no, it's eight. Why did I set it on six? Wherever in this world I roam, I carry memories of my home. Pick up some new pieces this blade. It is the last link I have to the land of my birth. Ah, oh, there we go. There they are. Today is the day of one's reckoning with fate, as foretold by the night sky. Humiliation suffered in the past, the shame we have carried all these years. One bids you adieu, for today it is time for... Retribution! <laughs> Main Fräulein, if I may be so bold, that final phrase did not sound like one of your own. Of course it wasn't. I just overheard it from someone in the city. Uh, <laughs> I mean, thy princessin is merely drawing on the wisest and courageous saying she has heard in the land to signify the importance of this day. I wonder if that someone in the city is Kazuha. <laughs> hmm, let me see... Huh, it really is someone else's catchphrase. <laughs> Aww... Wow, you're here early! Hi. Who have you brought with you? Oh, ahem. <clears throat> Paimon to introduce to you a fabled wandering swordsman of Inazuma and an enchanting musical talent of Liyue. Hey, I'm Shinyan from Liyue. I like rock and roll, sunny days, and good times. You must be the princess Paimon told us about. You sure do look the part. Uh, I hear you're from a faraway land. It's an honor to be in the company of dignitaries. <laughs> Seeing it has completely been taken in. And this lady over <gasps> here. My family tells me that only the wisest scholars wear pointed hats like this one. Uh, Guess that applies to you too. Oh, I like her. She can stay. <laughs> that synchronicity. Shenyan, your gaze pierces the dark veil of night to arrive at the truth beyond. I am in need of one such as yourself. Very well. You shall be one's musician laureate. <laughs> She's confused. She's trying to say thanks. You say all the right things. Um, and the same goes for me too. Pleasure to meet you. I'm Mona, an astrologist. No, oh, well, <laughs> it's nice to meet you too. 
<laughs> I'm having some coughing trouble. <laughs> My throat is hurting from coughing from laughing. <laughs> Mona is amazing. She can find out everything about you by divination. A princess? An astrologist and an articulate raven retainer. In the company of giants, my humble self hardly deserves mention. I am Kaidahara Kazuha from Inazuma. It is an honor to meet you all. I thought that he would be doing the, uh, the, the Japanese greeting, you know, the bow. What ho, Kazuha? <laughs> Divulge thy epithets in thy vocation. Oh, Main Fräulein would like to know where you work and what your field of expertise is. Um, I'm afraid I'm just another wanderer. This guy is an expert in the sword arts. He parries blades that none have ever parried before and strikes like lightning. Mere mortals could not hope to comprehend. <laughs> Thank you very much for that introduction, Paimon. Uh, is he really that powerful? No, I just go. Let me take a look. Oh, huh? oh, oh my! Yeah, they probably look. Mona's probably looked into how how Kazuha stopped the uh, the Raiden Shogun's uh, lightning. Hi, Kazuha. I'm absolutely delighted to meet a great swordmaster like you. Could we ask you to be our guard while we're on the island? One hereby declares you, Captain of the Royal Guard of the Imanakreish. <laughs> For even Lady Magistus to praise your skills, you are surely one of rare talent. Lady Magistus is absolutely right. Okay, Lady M Mag... <laughs> of course. Lady Magig... What? Just call her Mona. Uh, just call me Mona. Stop calling me that weird name. Does she not like her surname? By the way, Lady Magistus, we found out how to get to the Promised Land. A legendary great mage gave us a big hint. Come on, everyone, follow Paimon. I wonder what what Alice is up to. Okay, so where is it? Oh, oh, I I actually see it before the map came up. Look at over there. <laughs> Isn't that... Oh no, she's going to blast us over there? You're kidding me. You're kidding me. She's going to blast us all the way to the, to the archipelago? Look everyone, here's our vehicle! You can't call that a vehicle. It looks like a canyon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Somehow, I suddenly don't feel like going anymore. <laughs> Me too. What a... Uh, unique little thing. Looks kind of like Gwoba, doesn't it? <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> look at that face. <laughs> Why are you so... Sm <laughs> Why are you still smiling? <laughs> Kazu. Guoba. Is he the magical creature at Wanmin Restaurant? Now that you mention it, it does look quite similar. <laughs> really? Uh, to be honest, even Paimon isn't so sure this can take us to the island after all. Yeah, it's it's better we, we just go and hunt Venti again. <laughs> hmm. I see, I see. Only by meeting the lowliest of ends can we arrive at the Imanakreish born anew. Ah, uh, no, Fischl, no! <laughs> oh, behold, the doorway cloven by thundering retribution. By such means as I once descended into this realm to bring <laughs> retribution, do I now venture into the next. Come, Oz, lead the way. Ah, uh, no, I don't want to go in there. <laughs> I will enter first. Main Fräulein need not worry. Oh, uh, good luck, Oz. He's in. And now he's gone! Why, this truly <gasps> is the path of retribution that leads to the Promised Land. Oh, so, so it's actually a doorway, not a cannon-like thing? Uh, maybe. 
Maybe I should just do a quick reading for safety. Lady Magistus, it's fine! This is Alice's creation. It's totally safe. Spare yourself the trouble. Just come with us. Uh, but you do know that she tends to, uh... This tends to be all prototype spymen. Oh, right. I completely forgot. <sighs> all right. Oh, all right. All right, mentioning the name of Alice gives gives Mona a fright. <laughs> really, though, we have to go into the mouth. <laughs> Everyone expect them before one by stepping nervously by sailing to the dodo fortress. The journey is an eventful one and maybe a little so crowded. So it's actually quite uh, a bit of a space stretcher there. Come on now, let's all try and stick. Ow, Fischl, you're treading on my hair. I thought it was a snake. Ah, we're flying. Oh, really? Everyone, be careful. What's going on? How are we going to end up at the archipelago? We finally landed. What was that all about? <laughs> Don't tell me that thing actually really place. flew. The wind is soft and the ocean is calm. And a pleasant scent blows on the breeze. Wow. We're back here again. Did Alice send us a message? Yep. Paimon's feeling way better already now that we can see the ocean. <gasps> An ocean of life and a land filled with flora. Main Fräulein, we have finally arrived at the promised land whence we <laughs> shall revive the Imanokreish. Oh, faithful retainers. This is the blessed paradise that one has been searching for. Here is where we shall witness the culmination of all things. I'm excited too. I, who command the darkness, shall lead you to yonder gate of dreams. <laughs> <clears throat> shall lead you to yonder gate of dreams. <laughs> Mona doesn't want to play anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I guess when we got two other people in <laughs> who is first time meters <laughs> she wants to just quit <laughs> your archmage magistus thanks you for your kindness your highness in this moment <laughs> I offer my blessings to the Immernach Reich <laughs> poor Mona Mona oh. What are you, uh... <laughs> no, don't ask. Just follow my lead. <laughs> oh, oh, right. <clears throat> <coughs> Praise be to the princess <coughs> who has led us here to this sacred place. My sincere gratitude to you for inviting me to join you on this trip, <laughs> your highness. At least Kazuo can get, it, can get into the world quickly. <laughs> your happiness gladdens one's heart. Ah... <sighs> How it delights me to bring us all together here at this most monumentally fateful of moments. Now, as I take my first step on this pilgrimage, I shall perceive this ocean of life with my own earthly vessel. After all, this is where my soul belongs. On the contrary, Lady Magistus, blessed as you are with the great power of Hydro, one yet finds too many impurities in thy soul. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Main Fräulein means Lady Magistus is perhaps not the most talented swimmer. But she could actually just simply, uh, sprint through the water. Oh, Fischl, that's enough. 
I'm happy enough to join in with the play acting without complaining, but how dare you ridicule my genius? <laughs> oh no. If you can swim better than me. Ha! I'll bring you to your knees, young lady. <laughs> We're not even. We haven't even stepped further much, and the two of them are already fighting. Oh my, main Fräulein. Steal yourself, main Fräulein. Oh no. This story going to have a battle. <laughs> oh yeah. Swimming race. Swimming Whoever comes in last is a rat egg. <laughs> Five and don't is <laughs> don't fuel them. Ah uh, no. <coughs> Challenge accepted. Heed my words, lowly lady magistus. You shall pay for your foolishness for as long as you live. Ah uh, no. Ridiculous. I've never lost a single swimming race in my life. Bring it on. First one to run to the beach wins. Uh. Are they serious running? I thought they were gonna swim. Never mind, looks like they're enjoying this. I take it you have no present plans. I want to start by surveying the area first. Want to come along? Oh, Kazuo, it's good we can count on you. <laughs> Shinyan, are you coming? Seems like everyone's got things to do. I'll stay here and hold down the fort for now. Mona and Fish will have gone swimming and someone's got to set up camp. Don't worry, I got this. You're gonna take a look around, right? Well, make sure you let me know if there are any good views. Thanks, will do! Oh, there's... I need this for Kazuo's material. Thank you very much. I think I'll just, uh... Okay, I'll start by catching 10 crabs and 20 fish. Huh. Will that be enough for all of us? Uh, maybe I should prepare something else. Xinyin is very, very responsible. Hmm, Mona doesn't actually look bad. Ah, <coughs> uh, I remember that. There's this thing again. Yeah! Oh, reveal thyself! Pound Oh! <laughs> this is the picture of a uh, of Dodoko. Dodo Dodo King The Dod <laughs> Right, whatever. A fateful offering. But what are we going to do with this? Maybe later. Uh, if I remember correctly, right, wasn't this the... the Kong? The conch? Where we got, a uh, an idea about Kazuha? Oh, I guess there's no more... There's no more of that room. Oh, there are new... Oh, or... Uh, no, actually, I think this is the old one. It's just that the waypoints are... The waypoints have been resetted. Um, all right, so for today, let me just unlock all of the the waypoints to open up the island. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do for today. Since the 
the dialogue part was so so long and it was so fight me <laughs> my throat needs <laughs> needs to we need some <laughs> need some rest <laughs> from laughing so hard Should I use Mona's new outfit? These garments echo the magnificent starry sky. Oh. They they say something now? <laughs> Where's Jean? Mother's teachings are with me always. What if I go back here? Oh, she says nothing. In the name of the Gunhilder clan. Gunhilder clan. Uh, who else? Who else was it? Uh, Rosaria? Wait, where's Rosaria? Forget about the past. Focus on the future. Okay, and who was the last one? Amber. <laughs> Outrider Amber, raring to go! They put dialogues when you change. Hmm. Oh. Just a minute. It's probably because I... It's probably because she's not... Seeing and it's yeah. not... Power core! Delve into destiny! Fate is upon you! By royal decree! Feel the beat. <laughs> right. 
Right. Definitely. I'm going to have trouble considering this the fact. benefits to a life of wandering. Wait a minute, where should we go first? Ah, this one. This one is much more nearer. <laughs> right, we do have the cannons, I completely forgot. So I need to... So this is something that cannot be... Oh! Oh! <laughs> that was a disaster. Oh, there it is. <clears throat> there we go. There is also one that's above. But I need to climb to the highest part, I think. Oh, I can see the conscious already. Shadows of fate! Decided by destiny. Amp it up. No rest for the wicked. Midnight, Phantasma. Fallen leaves adorn my night. Let me scrub. Pyrotechnic. 
Not bad. I can already see the conscious. Four phantasmal conscious. Divination is about precisely foretelling one's. Oh no. Shadows of fate. Feel the beat. Into the wind. <laughs> Reveal thyself. Trip wind strikes. Not bad. Although I would probably need a healer. Oh, well, since we are... This is where we were the first time we got here, right? This is where we camped. Before Albedo... Uh... d -Luke and Kaya came. Razor did came, too. Well, might as well just collect this already. Oh. Again, that honor is... Imagine conch. Imaging conch. Oh, it's a Fatui. The Fatui's has been here? Wow, this one is interesting. Okay, so where is it? Oh. Oh, I think it's here. The Fatuis have been here? I didn't see any Cursed. sign of them back then. When did he leave the insignia? I can't just keep searching. It's getting us nowhere. I need to get to the next island. I can't leave Yakov on his own. Where was the other one? If I remember correctly, there was another one here. Time to go! Oh, there it is. Delved into destiny! By royal decree! As one with wind and cloud! Written in the stars! Midnight Phantasmagoria! Oh no. Shadows of fate! Power core! No rest for the wicked. Clouds high. The birds come! Amp it up! 
That was very dangerous. <laughs> it's because the other three are not very much go. leveled. Yeah, even Fischl is not leveled. Rightly. What did I give her again? She got Thundering Fury and Gladiator's Finale. Yeah, see? So... <clears throat> on this one, it's definitely Kazwa who's just have to carry them all. As the one who holds the highest honor among all of us, can't you take this mission a bit more seriously? Honor, Yakov. You need to realize that honor is more important than anything else. Chevka, I am sorry for getting everyone involved in this, but I couldn't care less about the kind of honor you keep talking about. Wait a minute. Are these the Fatuis that we met at the at the chasm? Wait. Is it is it really them? Their names could just, uh, be... S I thought I heard of those names before, too. Shinyan keeps on, uh, go- heading towards the, uh... There really isn't any more. Alright, where's the boat? Oh, no. I don't remember seeing this tree before, though. I remember there were only green trees here. Okay, anyways, um, this one is next. To end up. A smile to my face. I never once tried going in to the whirlpool, so I wonder if it's going to take us somewhere or is it just going to Oh no, it's it's wrecking our ship. <laughs> so that's what's going to happen now. Uh.
me and my curiosity. It's a good thing we didn't end up wrecking our ship. <laughs> our boat, I mean. Ah, oh, there are so many in here. Just what Kazuha needs. Alright. We got one here too. Oh, there is another one here. Right. Let's go to that. Why didn't it show up? First, let me just... This... C... Ganoderma. Let me just go around here. <gasps> Is that it? Gafia, let's take a break. Who knows whether we'll find anything to eat at all on these islands. Oh, it's not. This Agafia, I have never heard of this name before. It's probably upstairs. Uh, no. I'm in big trouble. Oh, <laughs> uh, no. Stamina, stamina, stamina. I need the 100 one. Here. Ah, uh, there's only one of these. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Still so far away. This was a very bad what idea. Nature. This was a, probably a very bad idea. One with nature. Oh, where is it? You're kidding me! I I came all the way up here. You're telling me it's not here? Where is it? Oh, no way, it's all the way down there. 
Wait, wait, what about the conch? Into the wind. It's here, right? At least let it be here. So all that climbing is not is not right, has not cigar. gone to waste. We're done with the signal testing on this island. Let's hope the machine starts up without any issues. Okay, okay. Come on, let's get to the next island and finish what we came to do. The sooner we complete our assignment, the sooner I can go back to camp and rest. I can't believe I climbed all the way up there. Wait, it's it's actually not here. Why am I climbing again? <laughs> No more of those seaguard dough now. I wonder if there's also a Mago Kenki in here. If the Mago Kenki is still here. Wait, is that the Fat? It's the Fatui Arbiter Camp. I can't believe it. Oh, this is the island where Mago Kenki was before, and now it's a. Uh... It's an abandoned camp of the Patui. What? There isn't any sea. Wait, is it... No, 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 no. Okay, the last... The last one. Although I think that there would still be some waypoints in here. 
because uh, some waypoints were hidden until until I I open up the the main ones. You're kidding me. Not even the cannons can get them. Smile to my face. Oh, I see the, uh, there are a lot in here. But I think I, I already have enough. Oh, right, right. I do have enough. But I still need some more because I still have two slots to fill in. What? Oh. Hello, my little beauties. Remember this one. Ah, uh, see.
there's another waypoint here which was not showing up in the map until I open up the main one. And here too. Oh, is this something we need to do with Shinyan? This place hasn't changed. It's still creepy during the night. I also see some Fatui camps over here. What is that over there? It's a Fatui mechanism. It's a Fatui mechanism of some sort. It appears to be some sort of machine. And an army cap with traces of hydro next to it. It seems that we are not the first to set foot on this island. Also, there are footprints here. Fresh ones. Likely no more than a few days old. Really? Hyman didn't notice them at all. <sighs> Traveler, Paimon, stay alert. Why? Did you see something? Someone was here, and they're still nearby. Judging from the scent, they're visitors here like us. There's other people here? Oh, Paimon's scared now. Come on, we need to track him down. <laughs> you're, you're scared now, Paimon, but you still want to track them down? <laughs> you said the cap had traces of hydro on it? Then let's follow the traces of elemental energy. Oh, I see. Probably from above.
to the wind. One with nature. Wait, we're getting farther and farther away. No, wait. They're down there? Right, they're down there. Probably here. Follow the wind. No, wait. We're close. Watch out. Oh, here he is. <laughs> Written in the stars. Midnight Phantasma. One with nature. As one with wind and cloud. Pyrotechnics. Why is there patchouli on this island? Isn't there a single place in this world without mint, sweet flowers, and patchouli? There, they get everywhere like weeds. Interesting observation. <laughs> <laughs> Cappy Cap's gone. Where's Cappy Cap? What? Are you looking for something? A cap? I, I, can't, I can't lose it. Oh, oh, the cap we saw. I, I don't know anything. Give me back Cappy Cap. <laughs> this guy is so weird for, for a Fatui. Is this the cap you're looking for? My brother's Cappy Cap! Gimme, gimme, gimme! He sounds like a child. You return to Cap to the Fatus. Uh, this guy is not the sharpest sword in the sheath. Mm, don't bully me or I'll punch you in the. Ah, monster! Monster! <laughs> right. Stop right there! What are you doing here? Another Fatus! We can ask you the same question. What are you doing here? Hmm? Protect Cappy Cap. Or brother will get mad at me. Forget the Cap. It's your brother we're looking for. What happened to him? Nothing. He has a fever. He's just a little delirious. That's all. Doesn't look like to me. I don't have to tell you anything. Go bother someone else. <laughs> this guy. This island belongs to our friend. You better watch what you say, mister. Yeah, we're going to tell Alice on you. What? I thought this island was uninhabited. That's why we came here to... Um, never mind. <laughs> he almost told us what they were here for. What's that machine for? <sighs> Fine. I'll tell you. But then you need to leave me alone. Well, it's not necessarily that he could probably he would probably not tell the truth, or he would probably tell a half truth. It's a new kind of energy generator that I invented. We were simply looking for a deserted island to test it out on. There, satisfied. Like we told you, this island is ours. Do not impede our vacationing. Yeah, and if you don't do as you're told, we'll uh. Oh, we'll take his cap! <laughs> uh, very nice, Paimon. Bully the kid. Uh, uh, please don't! <laughs> hey, stop crying. <sighs> Alright, I promise we'll stay within this area. Okay? Uh, by the way, um, why is there smoke coming out of your machine? 
Because it's malfunctioning, definitely uh, for sure. Because the cursed thing is broken. As much as I hate to say it, our tests did not go to plan. We were getting ready to leave anyway. And definitely, it's certainly for sure you're not the only ones on this island, oh, though. Well, just see yourselves out whenever you're ready. Bye. <laughs> Bye, Min. Come on, let's go. <laughs> okay. It's really so weird. I can't believe we have to deal with the Fatui during our vacation. Why would the Fatui appear in such an isolated corner of the world? Whatever their reasons, it's likely more complicated than we might think. Yeah. Speaking of uh, an energy generator. Well, uh, who was the researcher again? You know, the one who was making the toy, the toy at Inazuma. Didn't he say that Fontaine was currently having electricity problems. Is that is that connected? Even though we're on vacation, we should stay vigilant. I agree. Also, in the interests of keeping the ladies in good spirits, I have a suggestion. Let's keep this between us for now. Let them enjoy their vacation while the traveler and I deal with any potential threats. What do you think? Makes sense. I'm in. You're so considerate, Kazuha. Paimon, you flatter me. I simply don't think it's worth ruining anyone's vacation over a trivial matter like this. The scenery is beautiful. I hope all of us can enjoy ourselves here. Return to camp. Camp is so far away. There's also a waypoint here. Oh well, I guess that's, uh, that will be it. But, before I go... Oh. Oh, yeah. Transmute. Um... Power core! Let me scry! My royal decree! Come! <laughs> into destiny. All right. It's not so bad. I dare any more. See materials here? No, I don't think so. I've already gotten everything probably. Right, in any cases, I'll move over here, so in the next video, I can just simply go here to open this one. It's probably at the top. Or, uh, maybe I should check first before I climb. Oh yeah, it is there. You can see it. So yeah, I'll see you guys, uh, in the next video.